Hello everybody and welcome. My name is Jonah Yule. Uh, I am the president and co-founder of Fat Turtle Herb Company. I'm here in Beijing uh, and I wanted to share with you what I did today. I went to Bai Guan, which is White Cloud Taoist Temple. Uh, and when I was there, I prayed to various deities, including the gods of medicine, uh, Sun Tzu Miao, Hua To, uh, Zhang Zhong Jing. Uh, and after that, I went behind the altar to the uh, Chinese Medicine Clinic and just got my pulse taken by a uh, Taoist monk uh, and he wrote me a prescription. Luckily, there was uh, an English woman there uh, from England and she was translating for me, so that was a great stroke of luck. Um, uh, the exam actually wasn't that long, so just take my pulse, look at my tongue, ask me a few questions, write a prescription. Uh, and I found out later that um, this particular doctor, I don't know if it's the whole uh, Taoist uh, type of medicine or just this particular doctor, was a member of the uh, Huo Shen Pai School, which is the fire spirit school of Chinese medicine. Chinese medicine has many different uh, schools, um, you know, schools of thought, basically. So this particular school of thought emphasizes um, strongly tonifying the kidneys uh, in most situations, uh, as far as I understand it. Um, if you want to read more about it in English, you can read, uh, uh, look up Heiner Fruhoff. Uh, he has a website, classicalchinesemedicine.org, classicalchinesemedicine.org. He writes about uh, this school extensively in English, so that's where I learned about it. So fortunately I knew what was coming, uh, and they wrote me this prescription, and uh, it's got huge, pretty huge doses. It's basically Bu Zheng Yichi Tang. Um, the diagnosis was Yang deficiency, uh, which I wasn't surprised, I mean, since that's their emphasis, uh, many people get that diagnosis, uh, or variations on it. So <clears throat> they gave me this prescription. They have I can't really read the Chinese, but I can read because you know it's all in handwriting. But uh, I can read the the dosages, and it's you know 30 grams, 30 grams, 20 grams. Um, let's see, five grams, 30 grams, 15 grams, uh, 20 grams, 20 grams. So big dosages, uh, you know, big dosages of just about everything. And this is. I don't know if you can see this. This is one bag for one day. And this is like probably about a pound of herbs. Pound of herb matter. <laughs> um, and they also gave me this to cook first, which is Fuzza. A lot of Fuzza. So it's like, I'm not sure which one is Fuzza on my prescription, but it's, um, it's a lot of Fuzza. It's, you know, outside the recommended range as far as Bensky and Chen in our English language textbooks, and actually most uh, Chinese language textbooks as well. It's outside the mainstream of TCM medical thought. So uh, I'm going to give it a try though, and see what happens. Uh, and uh, it should be, it was a very interesting experience. Um, so that is all. I just wanted to share that with you. I also went and visited some pharmacies, some famous pharmacies, Beijing Tongren Tang, uh, Yongan Tang. Also, um, He Nian Tang. Um, these are all famous Chinese medicine pharmacies. They're here in Beijing. They've been around for hundreds of years. Um, the Tong Ren Tang Pharmacy was interesting. They had a lot of very expensive, uh, very expensive tonics. A whole floor of just ginseng, cordyceps, uh, sea cucumber, things like that. They had a, one ginseng root which was framed, which was like uh, 1 million yuan which is like, uh, I don't know, divide by 6.8. It's a lot. So it's a lot of money for that one ginseng root. So it's an interesting experience. Not really anything I've seen in, in America. Um, in Los Angeles, you can probably go to uh, Wing Hop Fung in downtown in uh, Chinatown uh, and check out. They have some like that, but nothing, nothing like this. Uh, I also, there was also a whole store down the street devoted to selling nothing but cordyceps. It was the cordyceps store. Also something I'd never seen before. Very interesting. Um, 
that's it. <laughs> bye bye.